Hey, Chip here. I just want to showcase a thing that my co-owner made. Um, this is kind of cool. So, what's going to go on is I need to take a trip. We're up here in Sandy Shores right now. And I need to take a trip to Cayo Perico. So, we got the private jet here. Jump in. Uh, got less than half a tank of fuel, and that is not acceptable. So, we need to fuel up the jet. <clears throat> Over here, grab the fuel truck. And the fuel truck is out of fuel. Okay. So let's go grab some fuel. It's still a little picky. There we go. Okay. Those are covered up. But I know it's press G. So we're going to fuel up the... And what's going on right now is it's emptying fuel out of this tank here and putting it into the fuel truck. And we've run out of fuel here, but you can see now, if I come over here, that we've got jet fuel. We just don't have the regular aviation fuel. So let's go ahead and fill up the aviation fuel. So you can see there it says press G. So now we're filling up the aviation fuel. Okay. The truck is now got fuel in it. So I'm able to fuel up aircraft. By driving to the aircraft. You see now the truck has fuel in it. Alright, so we grab the fuel nozzle. Find the spot, there it is. Oh, oh. Find the spot on the plane. Come on, we pick each other again. Grab the nozzle. When I return the nozzle, you'll see we did use fuel. There's no longer 2,000 gallons. Now the jet is fueled up. We 
return the truck and this is set up so that for a job you can set up any job you want um if there is an employee here regular civilians cannot fuel truck or fuel planes it has to be the employee Now we get back in the plane. You can see we now have a full tank. Let's fire it up. Once the RPMs get up to uh, 90, on the rotor scale there you'll see it going up there on the right then we'll be able to the brakes will be released and we'll be able to take off on our flight And the pilot cannot get out. If you look over on the map, the pilot cannot get out of the aircraft. Until the plane is completely turned off. So there's no, there's no bailing out. Heading off to Cayo Perico. All right, let's say I'm just a regular civilian looking for odd jobs to do. Um, I can come over at any time at any of the airports and check how full the tanks are. I see that Jet A is empty. I can start a fuel run. Press E. Gives me a truck. And I can see over here there's a trailer waiting for me. So now, I can go to the terminal, which is listed here. Down here, the fuel depot and get fuel. So, let's go grab some fuel. You'll see the green marker on the ground. Get your truck in there. You'll see it disappear and that little green circle come up.
build a trailer. Once the truck is filled up, you'll take it back to uh, the airport you came from. And you don't have to take that route. You can you can change your route as long as you get back to the airport. And once you're here, you'll see the green marker that you pull into disappear and get a new green marker over there. So you can unload the trailer. And what you're filling up are the big, the big tanks. As you progress as a civilian in first response role play, you'll have the opportunity to buy aircraft, personal aircraft. Um... If you're just looking for something different to do, you can go around to the different airports and see if they need fuel in their tanks. Fifteen thousand for the delivery. We pay. We pay the delivery price. The delivery drivers well because this is a rare job. Now, because this tank is still empty. Do it all over again. So if you if you run into uh, an airport that's got two empty tanks like this, that's thirty thousand dollars. You're off and running. Again, it's a rare job. It's an as needed job. Automatically pops up. So all you gotta do is just go around to the airports once in a while. Once you know people own aircraft, and just see if you can make a few bucks. Um, that is the server highlight of how our airports work. Um, hope to see you here. Bye.